What's going on everybody? It is your boy Hipfire Cum Shots here back at you again with another video and in today's video we're going to be doing a 2021 setup tour. So without further ado, let's get right into it and let's show you exactly what I'm going to be playing with in 2021. So before we get into the actual full setup, I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of a room tour first, just to show you guys kind of what I'm dealing with around the spot. Show you all the cool little knickknacks around my room because I have a lot of them. So let's get right into those first. First, we're gonna start with my rabbit's cage. This is my rabbit. Her name is Willow. She is a very fat rabbit. She's huge. She's a bit scared too, but it's fine. Just a quick little overview. So we enter my room from right here, as you can see. We come in. My desk is over here to the left. And over here is all my personal stuff, so like my guitars and a few things like that. And this little cool knickknack shelf. So let's start by going through this. This right here is just a bunch of cool shit that I have. Here's a lot of school stuff, school stuff. These are a few signs that I think really, really help my life. Like I'm not broke, I'm pretty rich. That's true. Here we have my Sidney Crosby, Tim Hortons hockey stick. Pittsburgh's my favorite team in the NHL, so obviously I had to go and get one of those. We got a few things up here, like the best whiskey I have ever tried. Canadian Club 12 years. Discontinued, so you can't get this. I'm actually saving this little drop right here for my wedding day, whenever that may be. This right here is my favorite Pink Floyd quote. All you touch and all you see is all your life will ever be. We have a few other stuff, like the Wayne Gretzky whiskey, some Pink Whitney, because I like the bottle, and then some 40 Creek inside of the decanter and my Epiphone guitar, which is not working. Here's a set of Pink Floyd picks, which if you didn't know, I'm a huge Pink Floyd fan. I messed it up so bad. Pink Floyd fan. Sorry, I can't speak. I have these little cool little beer bottle, bottle openers. We got Bud Light, Heineken, Corona, and Coors Light. And then we also have a Budweiser pressed clock, which is an actual Budweiser bottle pressed into a clock and my collection of beer caps. As we move into a little more personal part of my setup, this is my guitar setup for right now. I, I, this is kind of a temporary one. I do plan on having a different one. So really quickly, I'm just gonna go through this for all the people that may care. If you don't, it's fine. So the amps I use right now are a Spark Positive Grid, which is probably one of my favorite cheaper amps, and a Washburn Pro. Right here we have a Fender Squire Telecaster. We have my K12 string acoustic guitar. We have my Fender David Gilmore Stratocaster, which I actually built myself. Right here is my Beaver Creek acoustic guitar. It's my first ever acoustic guitar, and I love this thing to death. And right here is my Fender's 70s Telecaster. This is an official brand Fender guitar. This is probably one of the first guitars I've ever bought that is an official Fender slash Gibson brand. And this is just my little setup for it for now. I do plan on moving it and having it a little bit better. So now with that being said, let's get right into the setup and show you guys exactly what I'm working with. This corner over here is for streaming. It doesn't look like it because there's nothing there, but trust me, there is stuff going there. I ordered a full send flag, which is supposed to go right up here. It hasn't shown up yet, that's fine. I plan on having a little shelf over in that corner right about there, putting a bunch of cool little knickknacks like my G Fuel stuff on it and probably a few other things like my Astro boxes. This is my beer calendar. It's a calendar all about beer. Just in case you couldn't tell that I like beer, I have a calendar for it. We start over here, this is just a box full of Christmas candy. Nothing too special about that. This is, this is for my LED lights, so we can actually change these to be whatever color we want. They're a bit bright right now, let's dim them down a little bit so you guys can see a bit better. So we got white. Blue, teal, we can do orange, yellow, pink if we wanted to, purple, a bunch of different colors. It's really cool. We're gonna keep them on red for now. Moving over, this is my black web keyboard. This is what I use to actually play on. You see it glows red, it's pretty cool. It can change a few colors, change it to green or blue. We're gonna keep it red for now. This is my Moana microphone on a boom arm. This is so I can get better sound quality and a better sound range. So I can move this closer to my mouth if I needed to. I can move it away if it's too loud. I'm not sure what kind of Acer monitor this is. All I know is that it's an Acer gaming monitor. It's probably one of the best monitors you can buy for Xbox gaming. So of course I bought it. Here are my Astros and my Astro Mix amp. These are the best headphones 100% you can ever buy. I, these are the only things I basically use in any of my gaming and I'm so glad I got a pair back. Over here we're gonna move to my XG gaming mouse and a black web mouse pad. This normally lights up but I don't don't have the USB for it anymore and I don't really I don't really find it needs to light up it's fine I have enough lights in the room here's my phone we don't really need that we can get that out of the way so this is what I use to play Xbox on a daily basis I play Xbox on mouse and keyboard because I don't have a PC right now I'm planning on getting a new one in the new year so this is what we have to deal with for right now over here we have my HP laptop this is what I usually use to edit on it's actually a pretty good laptop for you know a laptop like they're not as good as gaming PCs to edit and do stuff like that on but it is it still gets the job done and I find it works just fine for my laptop here we have just a Logitech wireless mouse and just a cheaper mouse pad this is just to get the job done it's only there because for when I edit and do other stuff like that 
Back here we have a couple other school things and my water bottle, which doesn't really matter. If you wanna know any of the exact specs and stuff on the computer and all that stuff, you can head over to my Twitch channel. I do actually have a panel for my setup, so if you guys wanna use any of it or if you like the way something sounds or you don't like the way something sounds, then you can go ahead and just get it or cancel it out from your list. I do have a full list over on my Twitch for that actually, so you, if you guys also wanna see me live stream and play a few games live, Go ahead and click the link in the description below. Let's turn the lights up full for this, ready? Look at that. This looks ominous. Well, let's just get those off, it's ruining the lighting. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. Follow my Twitter for all of the latest updates. We tweet quite a bit. We tweet streams, we tweet videos, we tweet opinions. It's awesome. You guys should really go check it out. We're getting really close to 400 followers, so I wouldn't mind. We're also getting really close to 400 subscribers, so if you wouldn't mind subscribing, that'd be awesome. We post. Tons of sick content all the time. Also, like I said earlier, if you want to see me play games live and see my Twitch, then the link down there is for that below. We're really close to 100 followers. So I'm just putting that out there. I'm just saying. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video.